Hey folks, just want to let you know that I've upgraded. Actually, I'm thinking about upgrading the newsletters to include sound files. I was messing around a little bit with some uh, recording software on Sunday and managed to embed quite easily, actually, uh, a couple of audio recordings into the crude oil PDF file. That is the crude oil file, the crude oil newsletter for Monday, May 2nd. And so if you're a subscriber to crude oil and you download the letter, you'll be able to see a couple of icons that you can click on that will open up uh, the sound files for both today and for the mid to long term outlook. If you don't subscribe to crude oil and it's not available for you, just reply to the email that sent you this uh, video and uh, I'll be very happy to send you Monday's crude oil letter so you can take a look at these sound files. I think I'm going to expand this into other letters as time goes by but I would like your feedback first. I really want to find out what your thoughts are on having the extra audio input. Uh, one of the reasons I'm doing this uh, is because well for many years I've always been fascinated with the morning phone call I'll get from a subscriber who's asking for, I just need a little clarity on something you said here in the newsletter. I'll pull the newsletter file up on my screen uh, and I'll essentially read it back to them uh, exactly as I wrote it out on the page and yet they seem to walk away with a deeper understanding of what I was saying. So there's something about hearing me speak it or hearing anyone speak a particular concept, at least for some people, that allows them to absorb the material a little better, a little clearer. Um, a couple of things. Um, after embedding the sound files into the PDF documents, I noticed that um, you know it took a little longer to upload, so it'll take a little longer for you to download. Um, I am looking for ways to compress these files, to make them smaller or perhaps dilute their quality so they don't absorb as much space, so they don't take as much time for me to upload or as much time for you to download. But just know that I'm, I'll be working on that in the next week or two. And also, your PDF reading software, whatever you, software you use to open the PDF files, whether it's Adobe Acrobat Reader, I use uh, Foxit Phantom myself. It's a full suite of PDF uh, uh, software that I bought a couple of years ago, and that's what I use to read my files, but I also have Adobe Reader. Um, you may need to enable um, or disable, I should say, safe reading mode so that when the file is downloaded and your software opens it up, it recognizes that there are a couple of file attachments and it's not sure whether they're corrupted or not or contain viruses. Mine will not, I can assure you, but it doesn't know whether they do or not. So it, when you click on it, it, it you will either get a pop-up that says uh, disable safe reading mode um, or, or I'm not sure what will happen on your end but you may have to dig around a little bit and uh, disable that function on your computer. So um, I'm thinking that this may be incorporated into all the newsletters eventually. Uh, crude oil for Monday. I probably will continue doing it through the week for crude oil. And as the week goes by, add it to the S&P 500. Those are the two of my more popular newsletters right now. But uh, there's nothing to say that as time goes by, it won't be included, uh, included in the grains and, and the meats and so forth and so on. So um, if you could give me a little feedback, I would really appreciate it. Um, it'd be great to know what your thoughts are. Uh, do you make good use of it? Uh, do you not? Is it, is it a problem for you? Or do you really, is it really enhanced uh, your appreciation of the material and your ability you know, to understand it. So um, with that said, uh, once again, don't forget to email me uh, and ask for the crude oil file if you're not a subscriber. Um, it's a kind of a pain for me to go in and enable you just for the day. Um, but if you reply to this email and just put the words crude oil, please, or whatever the case might be, I'll make sure that I send it back to you as a file attachment. You can open it, listen to the sound files, tell me what you think. And then if I get enough positive feedback, I will include it in uh, the full range of newsletters as time goes by. Thanks much uh, for listening to this and we'll talk soon.